wonder how your candles were made? Well, now is time to find out. Cody has convinced Jones Candle Company yeah. to show us live yeah. on the show how they do this thing. Yeah, we went Sarah Jones earlier from uh, Jones Candle Company, and uh, I said, "Hey, can you kind of show me how you do this?" Now I'm so glad that you're going to do this uh, and show us how to do this because you sent me this little pack. I'm guessing this is the soy wax melt. I thought they were um, like mints, and I almost <laughs> <laughs> took a bite of it beforehand. Okay, so tell us a little bit about the process of how you make your candles. Yeah, so there's a lot that goes in prepping when you're making candles. Um, usually I try and spend about a day here at the shop just prepping, wicking all of the jars that I have, measuring out fragrances. Um, so what you need to do is have your vessel, have your fragrance poured, and your wicks. And then once you put your wicks in the jar, which you're going to wick it, you have a ready-to-go vessel wicked. to pour into. Wick it. Wick it. Mm -hmm. And then... You'll take your fragrance, mix it in with your wax, and of course this takes a lot longer. Um, you have to wait for the correct temperatures to happen, but you'll mix it. And then, after that, you'll measure and pour your wax. Oh. And then you'll, it takes a couple hours uh, for it to set. Um, and then you'll make sure your wick is upright. I didn't bring a wick bar out here. But basically, once it's ready, you have your hard that. wax That's in so here. That's so cool. And so you have the whole process there um, behind the scenes, and you're making these things in bulk? Yeah. The back, um, the back of my shop, I have everything. Um, and I make one day, let it cure back there, have my inventory, and then I just bring it out to the front of the shop when it's ready, and you guys can come shop. Oh, that's nice. Fresh candle. Do you have like a, you know, a, yes. the Krispy Kreme donut sign? Do you have like a sign that, and it <laughs> lights up and you know the candles are fresh? <laughs> no. No, but you know they are. You know, they don't leave this space here. So that's they cool. just come from the back to the front. Now, you've got this little pack that you sent me. Do you, do you have little kits where you, you can, people can do them themselves? Um, no, I don't. Uh, that's something I could think of. But it's, you know, it's... Once you get the recipe down, I call it a recipe. Uh, each candle maker has their own recipe. Oh. Once you get yours down, it's it's pretty simple. I think this is very interesting. I, I really, we are so <laughs> into your candle company. We've decided that your pa packaging and marketing, yes. you need to be worldwide. Yeah. How can we make this happen? <laughs> You know, it's. I actually did my first shipment to Canada this year, so oh, that was oh, really exciting, exciting for that me. That is very exciting. And were they polite? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, tell the folks at home again how they can get a hold of your cool stuff. Yes, you can go on jonescandleco.com. Uh, and order anything from there. You could also come into the shop every weekend, Friday, Saturday, 10 to 4. Um, or find me on Instagram, whatever works for you. Fantastic. Thank you so much. These candles smell so good. <laughs> My executive producer was in here sniffing them earlier. She was sniffing them. <laughs> she was oh. sniffing out which one she yes, wanted. You're welcome. <laughs> Have a yeah. good day. Thanks for joining us. We appreciate it. All right. Thank you. All right, Lori, back to you. You know, her, her oh. marketing and stuff is so good that Todd Kaplan could learn something from her. Exactly. <laughs> we haven't oh, forgot God. about him.